Welcome to our channel, Fast Cabling. Have you ever wondered how data zips across the internet at incredible speed? Or perhaps you're keen on upgrading your network to the latest, most reliable technology available. Where well, are you not alone? Today in this video, we are breaking down the complexities of point-to-point -point fiber optic setup in a way that is easy to grasp, even for beginners. So grab your curiosity and let's embark on this fiber optic adventure together. So in the landscape of modern networks, the importance of fiber optic connectivity cannot be overstated. As the digital era advances, Networks are tasked with handling massive volume of data with unparalleled speed and reliability. Fiber optic technology emerged as a cornerstone solution offering the bandwidth and efficiency required to meet the demands of today's interconnected world. Its ability to transmit data using light spots over a thin string of glass ensure faster data transfer rates and minimal signal loss. In a point-to-point -point fiber optic setup, a direct link is established between two points, eliminating the need for intermediate devices. And this straightforward approach enhances the efficiency of data transmission and reduces latency, making it ideal for applications where direct and high-speed communication is paramount. And the fundamental principle of the fiber optic cable involves total internal reflection, where a light signal bounces within the core of the fiber, ensuring minimal signal loss over long distances. The core, surrounded by a colliding layer, maintains the integrity of the light and allowing for high speed and efficient data transmission. Fiber optics outshine traditional copper cables in several key aspects. First and foremost, they offer significantly higher bandwidth, enabling the transmission of large amount of data at faster speed. Fiber optics also in mill to electromagnetic interference, a common concern with copper cables, ensuring a most stable and reliable connection. Additionally, fiber optics boast lower attenuation rates, allowing signals to travel over longer distances without significant signal degradation. And point-to-point -point fiber optic connectivity is a direct and dedicated link established between two points, creating a straightforward and efficient communication channel. And also, point-to-point -point fiber optic connectivity finds a diversification across various settings. In homes and small businesses, this setup is ideal for connecting different parts of a property or facilitating high-speed data transfer between specific devices. And it proves invaluable in scenarios where direct, dedicated communication is crucial, such as connecting a home office to the main network or linking separate buildings within a small business campus. So a comprehensive fiber optic system evolves various essential components. The primary element is the fiber optic cables themselves. Fiber media converters play a crucial role in converting electrical signal to fiber optical signals, facilitating seamless communication between fiber and copper network. And a small form factor pluggable SFP transceiver act as interchangeable devices, allowing different types of data connection. This component, along with others like connectors, Ethernet cables, collectively form a robust fiber optic infrastructure and enabling efficient data transmission in modern networks. And choosing the right fiber optic equipment evolves careful consideration of various factors. The distance over which the fiber optic connection, different fiber optic cables are designed for varying distances, and selecting the appropriate one ensure optimal performance. Bandwidth requirements also play a significant role, with higher bandwidth options accommodating larger data volume, 
and environmental factors such as the presence of moisture or extreme temperature should also be taken into account to select equipment that can withstand specific conditions. So now let me introduce you to some of our fiber optic devices. Here on the wall, we have the Compact's Fiber Media Converter. Now this is a practical device to finish fiber to ethernet signal conversion for devices in long distance fiber network system and also supply up to 10 kilometers fiber optical network between point A and point B. And the mini design can fit into challenge spaces to realize more flexible installation. And next, we have our Fiber PoE Extender. Now, this is a practical device to transmit high power and gigabit network for extra 100 meters by eliminating dedicated AC outlets. And it is available with 1 gigabit SFP slots and two 1000 megabit per second Ethernet PoE port. So it can be used as a fiber to ethernet converter or used in pair to create a fiber optic link. And each RJ45 port can support both IEEE A02.3, AF and AT standard compliant power devices and deliver 30 watts output power to supply high power IP devices. And last but not least, we have our waterproof gigabit fiber PoE media converter. Now this is a crucial tool allowing enterprise to utilize fiber optic link and supply PoE over long distance even in outdoor. And it comes with a wide range operating temperature from minus 20 degrees up to 60 degrees and carry a great electrical protection to against lightning and other power surge, saving a lot hassle to use extra protective measures and reducing frequent maintenance and replacement. And beside with the feature of wide input voltage range from 24 volt to 56 volt DC, you are up to choose different power supply to meet your needs and delivering a maximum of 30 watts of output power. Today we are connecting to an IP camera at the edge, that's why we'll need the network video recorder. And it is already connected to a monitor. Next, I'm going to use a short patch cord to connect the router to the NVR. Most important, I'm going to use an Ethernet cable to connect the router to provide network data to our media converter. Let me power it up first. You will see the indicator lights is on. And I'm going to plug in the Ethernet cable from our router. Next, I'm going to use the SFP transceiver. This is where we connect with the fiber optic cable. So I'm going to connect with our four string fiber optic cable. Let's use string A, plug it in, just like this, and then plug in the media converter. And here we have our fiber optic cable. This is a 300 meters fiber optic cable. And going over to this side, we are going to do the same thing. Make sure you find the right strain of fiber optic cable, which is strain A. Plug it into the SFP transceiver and to our media converter. I'm going to power it up. You can see the indicator light is on now. Using a short patch cord to connect our media converter to our bullet camera. Let's plug it in and it's already powered up. So the next thing we'll do is wait for the video to display on the monitor. Now it's already on, I'm going to wave my hand to show you this is absolutely a live video. So the whole connection is done. And now I'm going to give out some more additional information. Ensuring the longevity and efficiency of fiber optic networks involves adapting preventive measures to minimize signal loss and optimize performance. Regular inspection of fiber optic connectors and cables are crucial to identify any sign of wear or damage.
Proper cleaning procedures using industrial approved tools and solutions help maintain optimal signal transmission. And additionally, employing cable management techniques such as avoiding tight bends or kinks prevent physical stress on the cables, reducing the risk of signal degradation. Adequate protection against environmental factors such as moisture or extreme temperatures contributes to overall health of the fiber optic infrastructure. And as you embark on your journey into the world of fiber optic solution, we invite you to like, share, subscribe, and comment with any questions or thoughts that you may have. Your engagement ensures a vibrant community where knowledge is shared and together we can delve deeper into the possibilities of fiber optics. So that's all for today. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.